In this video, we'll take a look at this custom headlight setup that I'm working on for my CB500F Cafe Racer. Hey, my name's Ryan. Welcome to my garage. I've been working on this 2013 Honda CB500F Cafe Racer for a little while now, and I wanted to show you the custom headlight setup that I came up with. I'm using a inexpensive headlight that I picked up off of Amazon. There's a link in the description below if you want to check that out. If you follow me over on Instagram at SO9Engineering, you've probably already seen a few posts on this, but if you're not following me there, I invite you to do that. There's nothing really wrong with the stock headlight setup on this motorcycle. I just wanted to do something different and fun. For this project, I wanted the headlight to set as close as I could get it to the front of the bike and I couldn't really figure out how to do that using a, a headlight bucket. So I had to come up with something custom and this is what I came up with. So this mounting setup just uses a bezel on the front and a plate on the back to sandwich the headlight using the screws around the outside. And then I have the, the mounts that just clamp onto the fork tubes. The design was done in Fusion 360. I 3D printed the parts so that I could check how they fit and make sure that I liked how it set on the bike. I'm pretty happy with it, so I'll be having these parts made in aluminum soon. However, after mounting it up, there are a few changes that I want to make to the mounting brackets, and I thought it might be interesting to show that process in Fusion 360 in the next video. I'd like to invite you to subscribe to the channel to make sure that you don't miss that if you're interested and also to just see the progress on the bike. As far as wiring goes, it's fairly plug and play. I had to pull the wiring harness out of the stock headlight assembly and the headlight itself plugs right into the stock connector. This headlight has a daytime running light that runs across the center and I did have to do a little bit of custom wiring to, to get that to work. To finish up the front of the bike, I'll be adding a simple cowl above the headlight just to help clean things up and hide the wiring a little bit. I will also have to remount the speedometer, but I have a plan for that. I apologize, this probably wasn't near as fun as watching me fabricate a custom headlight mount, but the whole reason I started this YouTube channel was just to, to challenge myself and hopefully inspire you. So if you want to learn Fusion 360, I invite you to do that. It's fairly simple and there are tons of resources and tutorials to help you learn it. And it's free, so why not give it a try? Thanks for watching. I hope you will check out some of my other videos and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. I don't know what to say. Ow.